Elizabeth. Betty. Yes, Daddy. Oh my God. Oh my God. Jesus Christ. Yes, what is this? I ask you, what is that? Dad! Ah, I thought as much. And that's why all my best intentions to, to, to make you comfortable. You still indulge in immoralities. Eh? Dad, this doesn't belong to then me. Then what is he doing in your bag? In my bag. Don't even think of you giving me any stupid excuse. I'm disappointed in you. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. What's going on here? Your, 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 your daughter started, started, started picking, moving with dirty friends. I saw a pornographic magazine in her bag. What? It. Oh my no, God. Betty, tell me that is not true. <sighs> um, darling, you're not in the habit of checking your daughter's bag. You forgot to. We plan to 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 to, to plant a surprise package in her bag. Oh. You know, the, the Oxford um, scholarship form. I'm so, I, I forgot. I'm sorry about that. That, that, that was how I got to, to, to see the bag. Oh my god. Oh my god. Um, darling, I'm just thinking. Maybe they are using it for sex education or what do you think? What? Sex ed What are you talking about? Pornographic magazine for sex education. Was that how you were taught? Sex education. What are you talking about? Can you just imagine? Oh my God. I'm sorry. I'm just, oh just thinking. I hate being in a situation like this. But, but Betty, what has come over you? What is your problem? Do you know you have betrayed the trust your father and I had in you? You children of nowadays, you need all the help you can get. Mom, I'm sorry. It, it, it's okay. It's okay. Just, I don't even know what to think right now. My head is so, 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 so heavy. I have a business trip tomorrow. Maybe we'll talk about this later. By the way, that's for you. I trusted you sorry. so much. Why? I'm sorry. Drops this magazine inside my bag. Actually, I did. I thought you liked to read it. How dare you? Do you know the kind of trouble you got me into at home? My parents were so disappointed to find this magazine inside my bag. Wait, wait, wait. So, you mean your parents check your bag? Okay. Why are you laughing? I'm no, not why? Laughing. My dad was just about planting a surprise package inside my bag when he saw the magazine. Surprise. surprise. That's serious. <laughs> so, how did you explain yourself out of this? What do you expect? They didn't, they didn't even believe me. I mean, <laughs> what sort of explanation will I give to defend myself? Please, don't drop anything inside my bag without my consent again. Please don't. Calm down, Betty. Babe, I just feel you need to step up. Step up. Step up. No, you step up, babe. Step up. Step up. Sam, you deform my hand, though. Ah. Sam, you embarrassed yourself and all of us, including me, at the party yesterday. Why? We 
think they do, Yusef? I know they tell you, say, make you free this guy. Can't free him. Uh, it's just a late bloomer. It will soon blend. How long? Oh boy, you say if you no try, so it's only blend now. See, I have better things to do than partying all around. <laughs> you have better things to do. Okay, you don't want to party, you don't drink. What about girls? A life without girl is nothing. If you, you, any life without girls in your life, it, it's a useless life, my brother. Yes, Steven. Steven, that will be later. 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 <sighs> See, you are, you, you are just too dumb for my liking. You are not trying at all. It's a shameful and embarrassing thing for me to know you and you be my friend to be playing 2 0. 2 0 is, 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 is not bad. Wait, wait. What, what, what do you mean by 2 0? <laughs> This guy, this guy invest me. You are in part two. To any level, you have no gain in your life. You are playing two zero. I am the same part two. I am playing four two. I have four guests and I'm still counting. Be like me now. <laughs> Steven, you, you, you need a help. So, you, you, you now change girls like clothes. Did they? Steven is serious. Ah, what do you know? Uh, ah, tell you me. think everything is about reading, 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 reading? Tell him. Don't worry, we still have jam bites all around. Yeah! That time uh, is fresh! Uh, and like you both need it. You both need it. You both need it. Steven is doing just the bigger one. Oh, then rush up, boy! Rush up! You too dumb, boy. Like, what did they do? Now, I'm just going to put on the wall over the place. I bet you're going to start out time. I'm free, I'm free, I'm free, I'm free, I'm free, I'm free, I'm free. Come on, this boy. I'll see you on this one. Start going to your room. Start going. You, you, you. You know what? You know what? <laughs> I see what I tell you. Betty, Betty, right? Yes, Betty. Okay. Betty, I know that um, for the next two weeks or thereabouts on this campus, you'll be receiving orientation from the authorities. But from moi, Jessica, your roommate, I would say welcome to the University of Ephesi, where there is never a dull moment. Did you just say University of Ephesi or... Relax! You see, this is where life is meaningful. There's plenty of call party. You enjoy it and you have some fun. Mm -hmm. But what about learning? I mean, our lectures... Class is day, definitely. But you know, all work and no play makes Jessica a dull chick. And we don't like that. See, let me tell you, trust me. In this school, you need a lot of fun to keep your spirit alive. Basic truth. Well, I believe, yes, uh, we must not neglect our social life, but for me, academics has to come first. Anyhow, by the time you are bored to death with academics, you will turn into the fun around you. They won't teach you. But I really hope that you can see things from the perspective that we're trying to pitch to you here where your roommates is our responsibility to actually show you how things are done around here because we got here before you well i believe with time i'll get used to this environment yes yeah, sure but right now i need to call my mom and dad ah, call who? wait did they not just leave like yes i'm starting to miss them oh betty you didn't miss them yes like for real yes like you didn't miss them Jesse. Ah, it's I mean. Wait, do you know where you really are? As in, do you know where you are? Do you? Hello? Oh, yes, Anne, leave yes, baby Betty alone. I believe it. in time, she'll get the groove of things. Let's go for our lecture. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I beg Where you. should we go? Let me my issue, Jerry. I beg. Hey, I'm not even sure I have that my assignment. I need to get from that particular place before we go for class. So be fast. Yep. Because I saw a lady today. Uh-huh. She's been on my mind all day. Ah! Samuel is in love! <laughs> Rev Rev Father Samuel is in love! What's, what's the meaning of this? Sorry, I, I shouldn't have told you. Sorry, 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 sorry. Oh, sorry. I shouldn't have told you about it. I was only kidding, man. By the way, who is she? Her name is Elizabeth Ayamide. 
a law student in part one. Um, she mistakenly entered my class. I got to know more about when the lecturer questioned her. That's even when I knew her department. Wow. Wow. Ah, oh, wow. guys. Oh, Steve! <laughs> What's up, man? Ah, why your face can't be like this now? Oh, my God, I'm an headache. Headache? When will they celebrate? Ah! I'm celebrating. <laughs> I'll tell for you. Reverend Father Samuel is in love. Yeah! You're in love and you did all like this. Why? Why are you doing yourself? What, what's happening? And I love turn on to Mumusu. <laughs> hey, love things. Yeah, love. What's the next thing to do? <clears throat> yeah, this is why I come in. You no, know, um, bring the girl to the Stamford Bridge. You no, know, score some goals step by steps, and you win. Finish. Steve, is everything about playing match? Yes. Sex, 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 sex. He has not even met the girl yet. Eh? Uh -huh. What are we waiting for? Go and bring the girl and meet her. Talk to her. Bring her to his place. Let's do the thing. Do the thing before time. What are you doing now? Samuel, mm -hmm. don't mind Steve. You can always meet the girl anytime. It can even be tomorrow. Because I think it's not advisable to go meet her unprepared. Um, no, this is why I come here as a father and your mentor. I'll give you a step by step breakdown tutorial on how to do the whole thing, how to meet her, what to say, what not to say. So by the next time you meet her, just straight get her, bring her and do the thing. Finish. You are not <laughs> staying here tonight, Steve. Why? Is it because you've perceived the aroma of beans? Yes. You see, uh, uh, <laughs> well, uh, how much beans I want shop now? I'm going, I will eat small beans, I will give it to Even you, you see it to try for me, you know? Wait, 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 Steve. So you, you want to do it? <laughs> I will, I will. <laughs> forget it, we are. I forget it. <laughs> No, 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 be, be not the most important thing, but be part of the no, process. No, I don't want to do that. Go and bring me 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 that. I would not like to use the word stress. For effort to pass CAs and exams, I think hard work is more appropriate. What's the difference? Stress, hard work. <laughs> From my point of view, stress is a labor in futility, while hard work yields success. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Anyways, but you still cannot deny the fact that um, stress is a feature of this school. Well, who can dispute that? Please. Betty, I have to go to the library. So we'll see you later. Mm. Yes. Epico Mama. Ah, please, <laughs> thank you. Take care. Bye. 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 Um, my name is Samuel Oluwafemi, a practical student of English and Literature Study. Yes, Samuel, Hi. okay. Um, actually, I've been waiting for this wonderful privilege in order to talk to you. But academic activities have denied me of a privilege to talk to you. There's this space in my heart yearning to be filled up. <laughs> really? In this environment where we have more to occupy our minds than we can accommodate. Wait, by the way, how did you know my name? I don't recall telling you. Oh, uh, I heard you introducing yourself to a lady in front of the hostel. I, I, I'm sorry to say this, but I, 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 think, I think I love you. <laughs> you surely need to have a rethink. How dare you walk up to me and talk about love? You don't know me and I don't know you. So you have no audacity to tell me such rubbish. Uh, you, you, I, I, I love you. I, I love you. Hold up. Are you acting or something? In fact, that is it. I'm leaving. Huh? I, 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 I knew they would not have, I, 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 And I didn't want to do this. And if I just ask her, she would say no. Now she has said no. Uh, 
Hello, my baby. <laughs> How are you? Been trying to call you since um, yesterday. Seems the network is messing up. High school. Yeah, I just wanted to let you know that um, your mom and I will be going to the US by next week. We want to attend um, Chief Father's daughter's uh, wedding ceremony. Yeah, yeah. I just sent fifty thousand dollars into your account. Now, promise me you would spend it wisely. Do not squander it. Understand? All right. So high school. Yeah, she's just coming in now. All right, hold on, hold on, hold on for her. Hello, my darling. How are you? I've really missed you. We answer this question to the best of our understanding. But then, we may not have answered the best of our knowledge or the knowledge of our lecturers. It's not as if we can do anything about these grades anyway. We've already been giving those grades. <laughs> my dad told me I could call for my script too. Eh? Yes, my dear, call for a script. <laughs> Are you that name? All the lecturers on this campus will put their eyes on you. Mm? You keep failing every single course. God Still you finish. Hey. Sister Nakor. Are you new in this school? Uh -uh. Ah. Oh. Hi girls. Hi. Can I talk to you for a minute? <laughs> Can't you see I'm busy with my friend? It seems you still don't know who you're talking to. And who am I talking to? Oh, this is sorry. Get, 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 get back. You know the look face? See, we can double that our bad feelings if she feels too big than the one and only Skaposh <laughs> on this campus. <laughs> Brave girl. Are you not Betsy Emmanuel? Hundred level law student. <laughs> you stay at Commonwealth Hostel. Block C. Room 5. <laughs> Who on this car force that I car force do not know? See me at the Supreme Gate tonight. 8 p.m. And if you fail to show up, you have yourself to blame. Betty, you really need to look before you look in this school. The way you were just museum in front of that guy. That scapa, what's his name is, is the most feared guy on campus. The leader of every cult, eh? What's my business? <laughs> this school is hysterical. I only pray that my scholarship thing works out because I'm already tired of this school. Okay. I, I guess. Oh God. What kind of a day is this? Girl, I'm leaving. Oh, did I say anything wrong? Who are you? Samuel. Samuel. 300 level, English department. Huh? Uh, yes. Maybe you should try again. She's not in a good mood right now. Ah, but is there anything in the matter? Tell me. T tell me. What, what's wrong? Okay. Scarpoche. Eh? Scarpoche? What the hell is wrong with you? Don't you have liver? Liver. Okay. Tell me Scarpoche. Oh my god! I mean, I know, right? Yeah. <laughs> Betty. Yes? I noticed you've started developing soft spots for Samuel. Um, I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah. Well, I think you should think twice before you do this. Patience is a virtue, remember? I think he's a great guy. I mean, I don't see any harm there. But all that glitters is not gold, friend. I want you to think about God's plan for your life. Oh, Tommy, there you go again. What has God got to do with having a boyfriend? And what has God to do with your existence and remaining alive? And what has God to do with protecting you and providing the food you eat and the very air you breathe? Look, tell me, have you ever seen an investor who has got nothing to do with his investment? If he has nothing to do with the way you live your life, then why should he do so much to keep you? I wish... Tommy, please! It's okay. Don't ruin my day. Well... Guys, 
Remove this amount of pressure from the wall now. Ah, ah. So you have a girlfriend now. Put Betty there. Ah. Wait, with Steven. Now your mama with that. Do you mean now my mama? You are my your mama with me. So because I don't meet Betty now, make I come on my mama picture for you. Let me tell you something. Who better will be jealous? She, 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 she's not bad at all. It's no, cool. take my mama picture of the go. It's not bad. Your mom, your mom is and that even reminds me. See, this scarpoche interest in Betty. Mm -hmm. I'm disturbed though. Hmm. On that issue, hmm. all you need to do is nothing. You don't want to die anymore. I'll Just... buy a lover. Okay. Now that you love her, let me give you the real advice. Give me a little Leave this there for me now. Wear your clothes. Yeah. Go to Scarborough's hostel. Tell him to leave Betty for you that you are in love with her. That will solve your situation. Ah. Now, do, 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 fast, fast. <laughs> Am I insane? Hmm? I cannot go there. That was not bad now. After you want to have gone, Betty, we are to your graveyard. Behold, or oh, a lovely memory of my beloved. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Oh, the show you in love. What? What are you doing? Idiot. Love our boy. Okay. Oh, Ben guy is a very useless, irresponsible, and unserious guy. I know. But just which of the Bens are you referring to? Shana Benjamin. Benson. Bernardo Benz. Really? I don't know. Seriously. Mm-hmm. What's in your problem? So you think that I'll be referring to Bernard Branson or Benz <laughs> as irresponsible when I know they colo? <laughs> is that Benjamin guy? Now? You don't say the guy know they quick respond to financial matter. Who say make this girl laugh? Hey! Chelsea! No lame you did it. Uh-uh. Now that one I don't want here. That's one thing I don't want to hear from you. No, think about it. Now who waka come? She na me go meet the guy, I be that the guy come meet me. If you don't feel like man, make the guy pack to one side now. Don't they vex No, 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 they say they vex me. Ah <laughs> ah. Uh -uh. But you know say the guy fine. Oh. Uh -uh. And now you just think of it. You see, Jesse, if na me, you don't feel allow any guy. Slip out of my hand like that. He says, I did like this. Admission day open. Medic and a rule. You didn't yeah. help. Enter if you know Miss Road. See, I will have to solve this problem. Wednesday, you crazy. Where's your phone now? Dakomi. Dakomita. Spa. Sparrow. Wait, now make I enter first. Spa. Wait, see how you did shine. Make I make I make I make don't know the all right. Ah, we're not fine, man. See you, Jessica. You're not fine. But what's going on in this your school now? See, as everywhere just dull. There's nothing going on. You mean you guys are so blind to what is going on? What's going on? What's going on? Jason is throwing a party. Guess where? Blue Waves Hotel. As in Blue Waves Hotel. Hey! Jason, 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 Jason. Jason, uh. <gasps> mm -mm. Jason, Jason. Mm. Jason. The same guy that hosted us last year. Hey! 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 hey. 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 Are you serious? Oh, oh. I'm joking. Yes. Yes. I'm blind. Time to <laughs> party! Hey. Hey. Betsy! Hey. Betsy, hey. pack hey. that book one side <laughs> first. Baby, you cannot miss this all. This is a big show. You can't afford to miss this party. Jessica, you know I'm not that free to party. What is all Free. Free how? See, Betty, this is university. Ugh. It's not all about books. You have to gyrate. See, maybe Betty, I'll be... Students should not live by books alone, but by every efficiency going on within and off campus. Oh, oh shit! Hey! Ah. Hey! Ah. 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 I cannot do it myself. But what if the place is crowded and... Oh. See, a fight may even break out. Ah, so wait. If people they die for party, now that kind of party, it's a wee wee they go. Uh, no, if you don't die since. Ah, since, that's it. As in, girl, ah. you need to snap out of this thing and have some oh. fun with your life. No, no. Okay, um, but. But what oh, again? Uh, uh, uh. My dad must not find out though. That, eh? That, 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 that what? Who be the Who be the Hey, university picking. That is girl. Hi, free this babe. But anyway, it's settled. We're going for the party. Of course, are you Are you kidding me? Hmm? 
Bruce. Ah, uh, c'est bon. Ah, ok. Adios, Dio. Adios, Dio. Ah, ah, ah. So, what are you doing about this Betty of the girl? <laughs> Betty. Well, I'm waiting for her to honor my invitation. Then after, if she fails, I don't have choice than to hide out to my endless list of victims on this campus. I <laughs> know. <laughs> <laughs> I clearly understand you, guy. <laughs> Are you Jare? Not today. What is Carpos? So now we here. So let the plans go on. I day your back. I cover you with the guy. Naughty, naughty, naughty. Bring them all. What a day. Sister, see, the university is not paying that much. We are the ones trying to make ends meet. Yes. <laughs> ah. eh. Are you serious? In this same school? Wow, wow. Anyways, just send me her full details and I will be able to look for her. I'll find out, I'll find out, don't worry. Ah, oh, don't worry, no, don't worry. Just send me her full name. I'll, I'll make sure I find her. Alright, uh, sister. I'll talk to you later. Bye. Jesse, baby. Doc. Jesse, baby. Doc, you have not been picking my calls. You oh. don't want to see me anymore, right? Forgive me. You know, I told you I'll be busy this week. Mm? The Senate is expecting these results by tomorrow afternoon. Nice. I forgot, I forgot. Okay. I was wondering what happened. Nothing, nothing. Just work. Hope my baby is free for the whole day. How can I be busy? I mean, what would keep me busy when my eye don't needs me? That is it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me just round off and then... Okay, sure. Uh... Here. Is this not the angel that feels our wings can be cropped? <laughs> <laughs> I told you to meet me, but you didn't come. So why didn't you come? I never had me to meet with you. And what gave you the prerogative? That it was a request. I didn't ask for favors. I heard them in. And you will learn that it's better for you to dare God than to dare me. Because God forgives. I don't. <laughs> Good afternoon, Crab. Sam, what are you doing here? Um, I, I, actually, I, I came to see Betty. And wish she to you. She's, um... Why are you stammering? Can't you talk? She's my girlfriend. Your what? My, my, my girlfriend. <sighs> Sam. Sam. How many times have I warned you never to cross my path? How many times have I warned you never to cross my lane again? Yes, I know I'm owing you just because you rescued me from a rival. But let me warn you for the last time. Anytime you cross my path again, I won't consider who you are to me before I put you into your grave. 
and consider this a debt being paid. Sam, be warned. Bruce, it's time to go. Guy, guy, see, next time, now, nah. <laughs> call to glory. How dare you? How dare you call me your girlfriend? Have I agreed to be your girlfriend? Betty, Betty, please calm down. Betty, calm down. What do you expect me to do under that circumstance? I, I, I bet, I bet you, you know I've wanted Scarbo to know that you're not my girlfriend yet. Would you? You asked me to come and meet you by 1 p.m. I came, you were not even here. And, and then, that, that's why that shameless animal had the audacity to threaten me. In fact, what am I still waiting for here? I'm mm -hmm. leaving. No, no, sorry now. Sorry, just five minutes. Five minutes, please. Just five minutes? Yes, five minutes. So, it was a friend that fell sick and we needed to rush him to the hospital. I'm sorry I wasted your time. I'm also sorry that I called you my girlfriend. But, but you know that was my wish. I don't care about your wish. You just shouldn't have said that. But it worked. <laughs> Is there a reason I should say yes? Ah, uh, no, nah. No, 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 no. I, I just want your genuine consent. You know I love you. Eh? Uh, my love, it, I'm, I'm, I'll do anything for you. Me, I'm scared though. All you, you, all you guys, it's only when you need something that you behave like angels. But once you have it, you, you turn to something else. I just hope I'm not making a big mistake. See. Betty, you're not making any mistake here. My love, I will not disappoint you. Stop it. What is wrong with you? Have I said yes already? But, uh, Shh. Don't... don't make me regret doing this. Mm. Betty, you, you won't regret it. You will not regret this step. Huh? Okay, okay, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this, I don't want to do this close for the focus. I think this guy is right for you. I don't think you should be seeing him. Whatever you call his name. But it's cool. And I like him. I like him, yes. This Samuel guy? Yes. Hey! I don't see anything wrong in dating him. Oh, serious, I don't see anything wrong in We're dating talking him. money. You're talking cool. Now cool we won't spend. <laughs> I mean, what do you even know? But me, I don't care. I've just said yes to him. Uh, I've said yes to him. You yes. what? And he likes me so much. You said yes to him? Yes. Ah, I'm done with you. Do whatever you like with your life. I'm done.
that? It's me. Betty? Yes, it's me, Betty. Please don't pull now. Betty, where, where are you coming from? And why are you dressed like this? I thought you told me you were going to a night class. I'm sorry. I heard about going to the night class. It was my roommate. The, she invited me for this, this party and I didn't know how to tell you about it. So you lied to me. Now tell me, what happened at the party? No, I'm listening. Look at you now. One, you lied to me. Two, you made yourself the subject of the fight. And three, you waste your life. Betty, if you lie like this to me, do you expect me to believe anything you say? And I've told you times you down number. Your friends are corrupting you. Fine, they took you there. When there was a fight, they left you and abandoned you to your fate. You disappointed me. Sweetheart, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, please forgive me. Anyway, thanks to God you're safe. I know you've learned your lesson. Um, the bed is yours. I still have some reading to catch up. I'll find a place on the floor to sleep. Just, you, you need rest. You need rest. Just go to bed. Guy, I told you. You can't trust guys. Guys are not trustworthy. Well, you can't understand now. You don't know anything. See, Stevie, now you know. Anyways, she apologized. And she slept over. <laughs> you know, she? She slept over. She slept over in your house, in your room. Hey, what what happened? See, what why, why, why did you explain this to then? Who? Mr. Stevie, I don't know what happened. Listen, and I told you she's a virgin. Huh. You are the dullest man alive. You are too, you are a fool. Girl, you are, you are too. When they do you, you don't deserve me at all. When they do yourself. Girl, come. If you don't do this now, eh? Yeah. I tell you, sharper guys go come. They will launch the thing. Now, nah, Ajeku, left over, now you go shut Eh, eh, eh. I told you now. She has told me and I believe her. You believe that? Yes. You believe that? The guy that lied to you about her movement. So she can't lie to you about being, being a virgin. The guy think now. You don't get brain. Have you confirmed it? Uh, but. But, Sai, if you don't do that thing now, you don't, if you get a, the next opportunity, you refuse to do it. So you go regret it for your life. Regret it. You will regret it. I, and that will be the, your, your, the end of discussion. You don't finish with that. The guy don't go. It will not be the end of discussion for me. It's, see me, you can see a little bit. Ah! Okay. Good morning, Doc. Good morning to you. How are you? Doc, I'm not fine. Um, What's the matter? Doc, I failed Mr. Abel's course. Then I had an E in Dr. Martin's course. No, no. Is that all? You know that is not a problem. They are my colleagues. I'll speak with them. Okay? Now, let's get down to the business of the day. Which business? Is it and our business or cause? See. Let's do the usual, you know? Doc, see, let's settle the issues with these courses first, please. Jessica, are you doubting my ability to help you? No, 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 I'm not. There, there's no but. We know how we settle this now. Get it, come on. Doc, <laughs> you're never tired. Ah, I can't, I can't be tired. I can't. <laughs> yeah. Read for me or tomorrow for Mr. Adiki's test, you know. I have to read for you. I never eat anything, you know. You know you are the Adiko now. Okay. How many are beautiful? Who is it? Wow. Ah. <laughs> Hi, guys. Hello. <laughs> That's my girl, the way. <laughs> That's it. This is not fair. You gave some a hug, and you are giving me just a hi. It's so small for me now. Ah. Ah. Wait. <laughs> Come on, go. <laughs> mad, mad. Anyways, I believe you gave more than a hug from your girls. 
Ah, no, no, no. Joe un hobby special. No, no, no. Really? This young man, how's me again? Yeah, that. Go, go now. Two twins, are you guys stressed? Woo! So, what are you doing? I'm fine. So, how has it been? Uh, it's been good, but seriously, I'm really tired. Can you imagine? Professor Ademula kept us in class for four good hours. That man is very wicked, though. Seriously, he's very wicked. Uh, no, no, no. It's, but that's, that's, that's him for you. Uh, but I know you'll get used to it. Come back, so, I'm just tired. Um, <laughs> that's true. What, what have you had? Um, I took a slice of bread and a cup of tea. Ah, I mean food, though. Now, food. Does that sound like food? Anyways, let me try to get you a bottle more or just a, a more drink while I try to fix something for us to eat. It's okay, no problem. And when you're coming, please bring plastic water, please. This egg is cute. Let's run alive. You are too, you are a fool. Girl, you are, you are too. When they do you, you don't deserve me at all. When they do yourself, girl, come. If you don't do this thing now, eh? Yes. I tell you, sharper guys go come. They will launch the thing. Now, I just go left over. Now, you go. Yes. Yeah. I'm sorry I couldn't meet with you yesterday. I was so busy. Huh. But it's okay. I quite understand. I didn't inform me I was going to come. Uh -uh. You need to inform me. Find me now. <laughs> mm. It's good to see you. Uh, same here. So, did you meet with the commissioner yesterday? Oh, oh yes, I did. Oh, thank God. You know, it was about leaving his office when I got there. And when he saw me, he went back into his office and then the, later the secretary called me to go in to see him. Wow. Mm. 
and he attended to you patiently. Yes, he did. In fact, that man is a wonderful man. He's wow. so, so nice. That's good. I've never met him. <laughs> uh, so, uh, sister, what would you like to eat? Anything you like. Who is going to cook you? Ah, uh, no, no. I have a girl. A student? Ah, uh, well, uh, yes, but she's trying. <laughs> I did. Uh. That is not good enough. You kept under your with someone that you should be watching over. Eh, I'm watching over her and she's watching over me too. <laughs> but when are you going to bring your wife to this place? You know my wife knacks. And I hate that thing. And I can't stand that. She can nag a dead body back to life. Oh. Let me just be like this and enjoy the girl. But they, that doesn't give you the right to be dating girls, especially students. Okay, sister, please let's drop that topic. You said your daughter is in 300 level. For two science department. Uh -huh. The girl we are talking about is in the same department. I actually tried to look for my daughter yesterday, but I couldn't locate her. Yeah. But it's not good enough that you are here and you don't know your own list. Sam, so you know, my busy schedule, uh, where is the time to look for family? I, I can't say the last time I saw Mama last now. It's been very, very long. Let me call that girl. I'm sure she will know your daughter. I'm coming. Ah. Yeah. Uh, Your what? My... <laughs> what happened? Blood! What happened? I'm pregnant! Hey. <laughs> yeah. Ah, Mukbe! Oh, me! My dad is your niece! Me. 
Ah. Ah. My friends have ruined my life. They have ruined my life. Uh, yes. I'm yet to hear the details from him. Um, okay, let me call you back. Yeah. Shall we? Yes. Mm, sweetheart. Yeah. You know you haven't briefed me on your outcome to um, the embassy. Okay, okay, yes. okay. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I should have told you. Well, um, everything went well as planned. And okay. um, all I need to do now is to take Betty with me. That's all. Does she need to write any test? No, 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 no test. No test. Just that I don't want her to come past money for the interview. Okay. I don't want to see her in person. That's all. Wow. Honestly, you know, I can't wait to just take my daughter there. Mm. All of my friends have their children over there, and I don't want my princess to be left out. Um, she has to be there. Um, you know? <laughs> Congratulations. Wow. I'm so happy. So, we are relocating. Samuel. Samuel. Uh -huh. How you go come to class like that now? How far now? I did. As you come out, now in the lecturer, write attendance. So. Uh, you talk saying you go use and do see a new. Oh, I, I really don't care. You don't care? care. Guy, what's your happen now? Even my presence in that class is fruitless. See, I'm seriously disturbed. Waiting to happen, waiting to happen, waiting to happen. It's it. I'm, I'm seriously disturbed. Well, uh, it's about Betty. Betty? Ah. What's the problem with Betty? What happened to Betty now? Betty. Ah, guy now, Samuel, what's the problem with Betty? Talk now. Today, I, I, I deplore I deplor Betty. Ah! You displayed me. You did what? You did what? You shouted me. Why you shouted? You're a fool. But you, just, let, let me explain to you. Did let me. Explain. Shut up. You're a mumu. Ah. Did did did. Ah. Hey, what's up? Good afternoon. Good afternoon. How are you doing? Fine, I'm good. Okay, what's wrong with your friend? Oh. He seems to be in an unusually bad mood. Ah, did he? Oh, yeah. Hey, he misplaced something, so he's trying to, to, to look for it. Okay. That's not why I'm here. Okay. I came to ask you some questions. Yeah. Yeah, concerning you and Betty. Ah, oh. She has refused to open up to me, and I thought you would be in the right position to tell me. Betty did not tell you anything. She was no longer interested in the relationship earlier. I shouldn't question her further. Since then, she has been so moody and lost in thoughts. Uh, okay, um... Okay, I'm listening. Um, tell me, you, you've been a, a wonderful person and you've been, you've played a wonderful part in this relationship with Betty. But can I share a secret with you? Hello? Hello, Pat? Really? Okay, 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 okay. Samuel, huh? I need to get to my class now. We have a uh, test to write. We'll continue later, please. Uh, but, okay. Ah! Ah, I couldn't do that. I can't even explain to her. When they fix. <laughs> What am I going to do?
going on here? You've been skipping classes. I called your line severally. You, you weren't picking my calls. And you didn't return them either. You can talk to me. What is the problem? It's so well. What about Sam? Betty, why are you crying? Come on, talk to me. It's me. You can talk to me. <laughs> he defiled me. What? Jesus. <laughs> he did what? <laughs> oh, Lord. <laughs> Elizabeth, I don't need to man. name again. I thought you were human. I never knew you were an animal. Now that you've had your way with her, are you satisfied? Uh -uh. To me, believe me, it's not what you think. It's not what I think. You suddenly need Christ in your life, Sam. I sense the devil is about to make a big mess of your miserable life. Yeah, but I'll press that for you now. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Guys, see on this one I will the guy. I get one suggestion. I have some guys, some medical students, that can give us some things, some drugs, put it in our drink. And they didn't just come on the thing. Go, go come on the baby. Ah uh ah. -uh. Listen to yourself, Steve. Why not take her to slaughterhouse to achieve your aim on time? I think I have, a, I have a better suggestion now. There's some guys too. They corner her, beat her, kick her tummy. So you didn't just force out. You are so dumb, Steve. Ah! Okay now. Two of you, you not get brain. Since morning, I'll be giving suggestions, you'll be turning me down. Now give me your own suggestion. Give me your own. It's because you are senseless. You share the brain of a beast. Jesus, whatever you call yourself, never in your miserable life. 
Tell me that I share the bin of people. I, 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 you are a fool! You are senseless! What's wrong with this guy? You are, 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 you it's obvious that I need God. I need God. I don't need you. <laughs> you need God. God, Abby. When you do your uh, this thing, God is there with you. You you you, 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 you suit you. They call God. See me for your mouth. God don't get tired for this. You're useless to you talk. See me. Don't be you push me. I push. <laughs> I follow you go down. I mean, I mean, I'm taking you to go down. Easy. God. It will be too busy for you when you are doing all your immoral capabilities. Capabilities. <laughs> no, no. Uh, uh, when you are doing your immoral. <laughs> Let's cap it. You don't know. No, I don't understand what you're talking about. Elizabeth Emmanuel. You mean she's HIV positive? <laughs> Smart girl. <laughs> Be free from this shame. <laughs> I swear. I swear that boy will rot in prison. Mommy, <laughs> please help me. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. Come on, come on. No, no, you're not gonna die. You're not gonna die. <laughs> We're going to pull through this together, okay? <laughs> Promise me. Promise me you're not going to tell anyone about the status. Please. Let's keep it to ourselves. I, I will get a nurse who would come to the house to administer drugs to you, okay? Okay, mom. <laughs> All your, all your level of education and exposure. How could you conceal such a thing as serious as HIV? How could you? Oh my God. You are aware of the, of the, of the dangers and the challenges that lie ahead. How could you, how could you conceal something of this magnitude? Darling, you can't blame me. What could I have done? Tell the whole world and jeopardize our reputation. I don't even know why you're not facing your daughter. After all, she brought this on us. <sighs> you. You. You are the complete opposite of everything I have in mind. I wanted such a great and beautiful future for you. I, I, I wanted something. Oh. Why? 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 
you're supposed to go for, 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 your, for your scholarship interview tomorrow. But how can you go? In this your messed up situation, how can you go? Take of your life. Sir, I'm sorry. No, hear me out. I didn't do anything. Are you still that. talking? Will you shut up? What do you mean you didn't do anything? I, I, are we fools? How come she's HIV positive after you evaluated her? 
Well, I have nothing else to do to you. I don't even know what to do to you. Apparently, you're HIV positive, so you've um, gotten your reward. No, no, sir. I'm not HIV positive. I didn't. I had a test two weeks ago when an NGO came to our campus. I, I, I don't know. I don't even know she is. Sweetheart, he's just trying to buy his way out of the whole thing. Don't be deceived by this, oh. Let me tell you, there's no point arguing with him. There's a medical lab across the road. Let's take him there and get him tested. What was all this? Please. Please. Uh, go, go, go with it. Go, go. My dear, what happened? He tested negative. Uh, what? Who sued me? Ah, sir, are you sure? I made a mistake truly. But this what actually happened that night. <sighs> I'm so sorry, sir. I regret my actions. I only use my finger to... Somebody wake me up from this nightmare. Elizabeth. Hmm. Where on earth did you get this from? If not from him. <laughs> rushed out of Samuel's house that early morning when I saw the blood stains on my body. I saw Scarpoach. He, he ran towards me with an handkerchief and that was all I knew. I only woke up to find myself in the building. Oh, my God. All this happened. And you had the courage to keep it to yourself. You were raped by two men on separate occasions the same day. And you had the courage to keep it to yourself. I did not rape her. Are you stupid? Are you, are you stupid? Eh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> if you're not doctor, how would she have fallen into the hand of bread? You idiot. <laughs> So this um, Sakapo or um, Sakabula or whatever, Sakapo, sir. whatever, where can we find him? Now I have to involve the police. He stays off campus, sir. Shamore can just kapoosh him. Nonsense. Um, Mrs. Emanuel. Please, the next time anything happens, try not to take the law into your hands. You can't just go about the streets picking people and locking them up in your house because they've wronged you. You must be aware that suspects also have their rights under the law. These people can press charges if they know their rights. So please, let's be careful because of another time. Okay. And um, besides, doctor. Yes. Why did you insist on having the other suspect tested before we can proceed with the investigation? Because I'm confused. 
I'm even thinking of having her checked for, for mental delusion. Ah, uh ah. -uh. Hello, Nijie. My daughter is not insane. Ah. Well. Everyone uh, that touched her will rot in jail. Here, I'm telling you, I won't let this pass. It's all right. Here they come. Ah, uh, yes. What's the test result? The test is positive. Hey! He's the one. I didn't do anything. Are, are you still talking? Madam, madam, please. Madam, please. Madam, please. Madam, please. Madam, please. Please calm down. Please calm down. Please calm down. Please calm down. Ah. Mrs. Emmanuel, please, can you come back to your seat? Ah. I did not do anything. What do you mean you did not do anything? How can you prove you did nothing to her? Didn't you say that time before you took her to the to the building under construction? Yes, it's true, I said that. Her. But I did not do anything. I did not do anything when I found blood stains on her body. It was so irritating. Oh, now that I am HIV positive. Uh, so anyway, right. officer, yes, please take the suspects back into their cells. Yes, sir. Ah, HIV positive. Hey, this um, is confusing. What is going on? Um, um, DPO. Ah. DPO. Who on her infected my daughter with HIV? So real. Betsy, what is the test result that was given to you? Yes. Where is the test results? I, I couldn't collect it from the hospital. Uh, why? I left immediately after I heard the doctor's declaration. Hmm. Well, in that wise, uh, I'll just advise that you get back to the hospital where she was tested and get the results. In fact, we will need that as an evidence against the culprits in the court. Hey! Oh, Please, sir. How may I help you, please? Please, uh, my daughter came here last week for a test and uh, she was diagnosed with HIV. Okay. And um, she couldn't wait to collect the results and um, wait for the necessary medical counseling, you know, out of fear. What's her card number? Soro! Ah, ah. I can't remember. Oh. And what's her name? Uh, Elizabeth. E e Elizabeth Emmanuel. Right. Just a few minutes, please. Thank you. Face. You were brought here last week when you fainted in the school. Well, you, did, you didn't wait to see the doctor. What happened? Um, no, ma. It was when I heard the doctor declare to you that I am HIV positive. That's when I ran away with my friend. Oh my God! I remember what happened that day. No, I don't understand what you're talking about. Elizabeth Manuel. Um, no. Ah, you mean she's HIV positive? My God. Okay, okay. Um, I'll call you back. Uh, All right, let her come in. All right, sir. Yeah. Jesus. Hey. Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus. Ah, thank Jesus. you, thank you, thank you. Ah. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus. Hey. Oh, this oh. was show. Hey! Come on, Shelly. Come on, Shelly. Come on, Shelly. My princess. Princess. What happened? Princess. Uh, what happened? Uh, princess. Just, 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 Jesus. Hey. Jesus. Hey. I'm sorry, please. I'm sorry. You're sorry. sorry. Oh, ah. God. Hey. Okay. Hey. 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 Hey.
Oh God. And this guy is expanding. God. God. Wait. I was going to tell you. I was going to tell you that I am sorry for keeping you waiting. Oh. Eh? <sighs> anyway, um, from the examination that we carried out, yes. um, the good news is that uh, our HIV status is negative. Ah. Jesus. Yeah. Thank Jesus. you, Jesus. Hey. And, um, she... Secondly, she is fine. She is fine. She is fine. Mm. Um, we also discovered that uh, Though our uh, eye man was tampered with, but there is no evidence of penetration whatsoever. Yeah. And lastly, lastly, she's really, really exhausted, so she needs a lot of rest. What we discovered is actually malaria, acute ah. malaria. Rest? Yes, she, she needs will a lot have of rest. enough of it. Um, but no HIV. Ah, no, no, she's okay. She's ah. okay. So, thank, um, you. Okay. thank you. Thank you, Doctor. Right, so hey, can we see her? No problem. Thank you. No, you can't. Ah. No, I'm fine. Sir, my DPO said I should bring this young man to you and ask if you should release him or if he's charging to court. Somewhere. Somewhere. I was told you used to be a Christian. What happened? What happened to your Christianity? You hid your identity in God so that you could enjoy the pleasures of campus. Now, see how much trouble it has brought you now. Hmm? Oh, no, no, I did not wait now. Oh, just shut up! Shut up! If you are not nursed this ungodly ambition to, to have your way with her, you would have drugged her. That's perfect way for you to, to, to have your way with her. She would have left your place whole. God's mercy has kept my family from, from a much serious My beloved, <laughs> <laughs> but it's really a love. What's going to do? Idiot, now, no, boy. One day, I can't do to one room. Yeah, Edem, Edem, Edem. 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 Edem, Edem, Edem.
Oh, 